just like your smartphone combines your apps, games, and media, Keyport combines your keys, everyday carry tools, and smart tech into the ultimate everyday multi-tool you will use dozens of times a day, every single day. I've been designing multi-key devices for over 10 years. Today, I'm proud to introduce two new key ports with more multi-tool and tech features than ever before. The Keyport Slide 3.0, which works with our patented Keyblades, and the Keyport Pivot. Based on some of my original designs from over a decade ago, works with your existing keys. Both new products are all metal and engineered to accept our brand new multi-tool and tech features such as the Bluetooth locator, knife blade, and LED flashlight. Each device is totally customizable for any type of user. Keyport's mission is to create a system that allows each user to consolidate and customize their own unique set of tools and keys for everyday life. We try to integrate customer feedback into everything we do. The features in our new products are a direct result of our customers' requests. The Keyport Slide 3.0 is made of precision machined aircraft grade aluminum with a spring steel frame. The ergonomic soft touch side plates are interchangeable with our new tech and tool modules. The keyboard keyblades and inserts slide in and out with your thumb as needed. Like the slide, the keyport pivot is made of aircraft aluminum with stainless steel components and works with our new tech and tool modules. The flexible linkage allows the device to expand from four to nine of your existing keys and various keyport inserts. Our new low profile lanyard attachment locks to the end cap when not in use. The biggest complaint about keys is losing them. The tracker compatible key port locator is a Bluetooth low energy crowdsource locator that helps you keep track of your key port at all times. Our most popular request from EDCers is the addition of a knife blade. So we partnered with Klecker Knives to develop our knife module. The key port knife provides a sturdy cutting blade that can easily be removed for airline travel and then just as quickly reattached when you unpack your luggage. We're creating a partner platform for makers, students, and companies to create compatible modules for our products. We can't wait to see what you come up with. To top it off, we have upgraded our Lost and Found program. This new online Lost and Found service connects owners and finders directly and anonymously at a click with no middleman or number to call. Once you register your keyport with Keyport ID, you'll be able to use that same number on your other valuables such as your phone, laptop, and even your wallet. Such a service typically costs around $20 per year, but we're including the first year free with any slide or pivot reward. We think things should be easy and that you shouldn't have to waste time on everyday frustrations like this. So we designed Nimble. Nimble is the world's first one finger cutting tool. You can use Nimble to open almost any type of packaging made from plastic. And Nimble isn't just for opening packaging. It can be used to cut out vouchers for crafts, present wrapping and more. I believe solutions should be simple and that's what we've achieved with Nimble. We made countless prototypes of Nimble during development and tested them with over 150 volunteers around the country to make sure that Nimble does the job better than anything else out there. Its rubber body is specially designed to be one size fits all, so you don't have to worry about choosing the right size. You can use Nimble with either hand, left or right. A safe blade design means that although awkward packaging should be afraid of Nimble, you needn't be. Nimble's blade is made out of zirconia ceramic, a special material which is much harder than steel. 
so you won't need to worry about finding a replacement anytime soon. Nimble's bright colour means you can be confident that you won't lose it in a kitchen or desk drawer. Its compact and portable size makes it ideal to have around the home or on the go. We believe Nimble can save you time and frustration on a daily basis. We've worked really hard to get Nimble to the point it's at now, and now we need your help to take the last big step and get Nimble produced on a larger scale. So please back us and say goodbye to Rap Rage with a swipe of your finger. I'm Chris Hawker, inventor of the Quickie and founder of Trident Design, an invention laboratory in Columbus, Ohio. The Quick Key was one of those inventions born out of necessity. I was constantly using my keys to open packages which didn't work very well, and also using other items like credit cards and pennies to pry, scratch, slice, and unscrew things. Pocket knives and multi-tools are bulky and cumbersome, so I never wanted to carry one on me. So I set out to make a simple, effective, and compact solution, and what I arrived at was the idea for the Quick Key, a simple multi-tool the size and shape of a key. I brought the idea to my designers at Trident Design, and together we turned the idea into an engineered reality, sketching, modeling, and 3D printing a ton of different concepts until we found the perfect solution. Originally, I was after something that could open boxes and letters more easily than a key, but then I realized that there was an opportunity for it to do more. We added a number two flathead screwdriver, a no-brainer, and what self-respecting designer wouldn't have added a bottle opener? Once we had tested a few 3D printed versions, we moved on to having stainless steel milled prototypes, and after a couple of iterations, we got our Quick Key, the handy little tool that opens everything but doors. Although Trident has brought dozens of products to market using traditional methods, we wanted to give you all the opportunity to be innovators with us on this project. We are excited to work on this fun little project with you, and if you like what you see, please take a look at our rewards and back us. Thank you for your support. Hey, it's Tracy. Leave a message. Tracy, it's it's Frank. Listen, I was driving to meet you, and and I hit these people on the road. I got out to help them, and they attacked me. It's like they weren't alive, and then they, they started to chase me. I, I, I just started running, and I was able to, to get inside that old mental hospital off of South Street. I'm hiding out here, and... Frank, it's me. 
come camping out for the night. I'm gonna get going again when the sun rises. Just, just wait there, I know I'm close. Okay, I'll be there. I love you.